I actually thought it would be a really worthwhile video to do it to give you guys a behind the scenes of how we started with our social media, how it's grown now, the types of videos we do. I'm on location with my videographer Joe. Hey Joe. I don't know. I like to get Joe in front of the camera, but he only really likes to be behind the camera, isn't that right, Joe? Yeah. And Hello! <laughs> <laughs> We're getting back 2024. We're going up another level. I kind of wish we started in June and not January, but sure, we said we'd give it a go. We're up here in the Wicklow Mountains shooting this lovely 835 AMG, so keep an eye out on the socials for it. Welcome to episode three, a day in the life of a female car dealer. First of all, if you've made it this far, fair play to you because the last couple of videos have been just a bit all over the place as I'm still learning. But I really thought about, okay, what do I want to do for the next video? The really most important part of the business is social media and marketing. And Asher Motors is categorically the most well-known garage in Ireland. When I started the social media in 2020, 2021, I wanted to do something that was never done before. So what I started doing was cinematic videos of cars we had in stock that was done like a movie style. Now you might say to yourself, that just sounds mental. That's really what got the attention initially is that a lot of people saw the effort we were putting into our car videos just to sell a car. And it's never been done before. Traditionally, you know, you walk into a garage, you buy a car, and, this is like selling cars in a whole new way. So that's what really gained the attraction initially. You might, might not even see these videos because they're done so long ago and they didn't get like huge, huge viral views, like say the TikTok, but like they've done well. So like this was kind of our first big one. <laughs> AM Productions, who did, who did I think I was? It's the biggest art heist in history. Stolen paintings, the end will wait. And then we had like characters, you know, like the boss. And then the, oh, this was just fantastic. We had great characters. Dangerous Dave. <laughs> oh. Dangerous Dave in the campsite having a few fights. And then this guy. And then one of my best friends, Phil, with Charlie the Chef. With Charlie the Chef. So like this is the type of stuff and then I'm such a movie buff. I love, love movies so much. So I always try and have like a sort of a movie theme or something that's gonna really resonate with customers because as I've done my brand building, it's not about my ego. It's not about here's my car I'm trying to sell. It's about giving you guys actual value uh, in, in terms of the content. You know, anyone can say, oh, hi, here he is, go guys, look what I've got into stock, aren't I great? No one cares about that. Everyone knows you're trying to sell a car. So what am I gonna do to you to connect with the audience? Am I gonna make you laugh? Am I gonna make you cry? And that's really the approach to Asher Motors. We're not just a car dealership that sell cars, but actually we're like a creative hub here where the social media, the content creation is just on par with the car selling. That's why others can catch up with us because we are constantly evolving, constantly ever changing. So you might not even know we've done these videos because you're only joining on the journey now, but this is all the groundwork that we've done. Um, I'm gonna show you the different platforms I have. And even though you might spend a fortune on your videos, sometimes the ones that do the best are the ones that just are simple and just hit the heart right like this is what really blew up my tiktok this video got nearly 30 million views 30 million views i can't believe it and after spending like a fortune on the different videos and then just this one getting it you know and that's it like sometimes it's the ones that are just quickly done like that has nearly three million views so like these are just kind of the big ones, but I have a load of like ones that have 700,000, two, 300,000, like a load of them. Like this one, so simple, 320,000 views. So like you have to be across all the different platforms for TikTok um, and then for Instagram. 73,000 followers, all organic. <laughs> this song is haunting my dreams. So 
This got 10 million views. Right? You can now take a step back from the day-to-day -day stuff and try push now brand, video, social media, and then... So very exciting today. I've been invited out to do a podcast in Dublin by a recruitment business called Sanderson and it's all about talent matters and there's a bit of a celebrity going to be up here so hopefully I'm going to get a glimpse of him um, with the camera you know I'm not going to say who it is just in case yeah. <laughs> yeah so Ryan has offered to drive me up into Dublin du like I'm from Dublin originally but I've been in Wicklow for 10 years and it's just crazy to me that the roads have not gotten any better to get in and out. We have more population, more cars on the road. But the road's still the same. There's traffic at every hour. So I didn't want to be stressed having to like find parking. So Ryan so kindly is driving me in. We're taking the Vogue today. Very comfortable car to take into the city centre. And I'm really excited to do the podcast. I love doing podcasts. It's a video one as well. And it's all about Ashford Motors and the business and that. So it's just again to push the brand out there even more to other platforms and other audiences to have a look at it so yeah so there we are what do you think what do you think Ryan yeah I think it's be interesting excited excited to be my chauffeur for the day oh yeah it's great it gets Ryan a out of, hours off work yeah <laughs> park up around the corner and, and have a snooze for, for half an hour <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'd be doing but uh, yeah so Ryan how do you like work fresh motors great opportunities to end natural matters <laughs> only for me then only for <laughs> Ryan no one else oh, yes. and because Ryan's been with us for about a year and a half now and he really is amazing and he really he wears a lot of hats in the business and he kind of looks after really everything you know that needs to be done he can get the hands dirty and he could be underneath a car fixing things or you know he'd be out selling 100 grand cars or he'll be organizing the servicing work or any warranty work and stuff like that so he, he's really been um, a huge huge part of the business the business's growth he's also taken a lot of pressure off me to be able to concentrate on the social media and pushing the business and without him I would have been able to do that so he's great but don't get a big head all right <laughs> I won't <laughs> and what what have you learned in the mode trade in the last couple of years that you didn't know about Ryan when you started I suppose with any business I mean you learn I've learned a lot about business in general and like all the aspects of business that come with it you know Me costs <laughs> costs that no one knows about yeah I know uh, you know how to deal with people the customer service aspect of things I mean even mechanically you know you pick up a good bit even if you're not working on various you're picking up a good bit of mechanical knowledge um, all sorts really I mean you never know yeah. what you're going to be doing in Ashford Motors <laughs> every <laughs> day is different isn't yeah, it every day is different and there's no real there's no routine it's like I even started my acting career in Ashford yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah that's the thing yeah Ryan Ryan actually how we met Ryan is he started out being one of our videos and because he kept coming up showing up to the garage every week and we we're like oh what's this lad want again like for god's sake oh any work and he just kept asking for work asking for work and eventually we we're like yeah okay fine come in don't ask you don't get exactly i come in and clean the yard there and then at night time we'll throw you into a movie <laughs> uh, so that's kind of how he started but yeah it's very different like there's no routine to the week which sometimes is hard especially if you like having a routine but then some days are dead some days are busy you're always going to be you're going to have a different week every week like no one week is the same and i suppose in that aspect it's good you know so yeah uh i'll talk to you in a bit down here at it's factory, factory 44, 44 that's it yeah factory 44 which is uh it's an amazing space actually for podcasts media to c content creation all that type of stuff exactly. and what you do is you sign up like a monthly yeah. gym membership yeah. and you can come in here and get your photography your media your podcast everything which is which is quite cool so i'm very excited i was here today doing a podcast with donal from sanderson recruitment uh, for the new podcast show called talent matters and they've got some amazing guests and I'm going to show you who they have on just next. We but won't say too much. We won't say too much actually. Yeah, maybe, you know, I'm here <laughs> divulging everything. Who knows, maybe I'll be on special forces soon. But uh, and there is Daniel and it's a really, really cool space. Really kind of colourful and yeah, no, it's just fabulous. Yeah. For energy. So if you're looking to do podcasts, photography, videography, Come in and have a look Anything. at us here. And where can we find you on like social media yeah, or how you, do we get in contact with you? You can look at us on uh, Factory44 on Instagram and our website as well. Cool. Kung Fu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah.
years ago. We were on the national team, Taekwondo. Yeah. So we were, we were all over the place. Right? Yeah. 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 But you know what? I, I did it when I was very young. Yeah. 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 Oh, and yeah. the respect and the... Absolutely. Like, I was lucky because... Uh, I mean, yeah. 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 So there's the next guest you might know. It's Ray from Special Forces. A wise man, but also kung fu guy. Thank you so much for the support. I know this is like a lot of you guys to stick with. Um, yeah, so any more ideas for me? If you want to leave a comment below, don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe. Any questions, let me know and I'll always do my best to answer. Thank you so much. Lots of love.